Hello everybody, my name is Gatem War. Welcome back to another video of Republic at War, the sub mod for Empire at War. We're gonna continue this series, of course, boys. We're in the third episode right now. Uh, last video we invaded uh, Frasia. Uh, uh, we invaded Megiddo, and we also invaded, uh, I think, Raxus Prime. Not yet. We haven't inv uh, invaded Raxus Prime. We're about, just as about to do it. We're still working on our fleet over Coruscant right here, so let's look at our fleet really quick, what it looks like. Okay, yeah, we're still working on it. We are about as well to attack Foros, so I think that's what I wanted to do in this video. Attack Foros, attack the other one that's over there, which is Raxus Prime, of course, okay. And we're also going to need to move up our our army, the Pride of the Core. We're going to need to move him up. To a best team right now because it needs to do something. I mean, eventually it's gonna need to do something. So let's start this up really quick. There we go. It might actually lag a little bit. It might do it. Now we're gonna do the uh, the two first battles uh, first. I wanna do with uh, the one with Obi Wan at four hours first. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it in time. Because the Pride of the Core is going pretty fast, so let's try it out. No, okay, so I didn't have enough time, but... Alright. Pride of the Core is already in Bastine. We're gonna defeat these guys pretty easily. You're gonna see uh, how large that thing is. It's uh, an absolute monster, so... Let's do the battle. Look at that monster, boys. Look at that gigantic monster. And... Just imagine how much fighter, uh, fighters it's going to produce. I already had a lot of like uh, destroyers and stuff for our big frigates, capital ships. Imagine now what I can do with that monster itself. With the amount of she uh, like fighters, sheer fighters I can basically do. It's it's just unbelievable uh, overall, overall, boys. Okay, let me just because it's going to produce a lot of ships. Okay, no, I don't want that. It's gonna produce a lot of ships, boys, and we need... I need to move, form them up, basically. Every time I need to form them up, it's unbelievable. Really, that's, that's a lot of ships. That's unbelievable. I don't even know how I'm supposed to uh, move them all up like that in uh, at once. God damn. A lot of fighters, boys. I don't even know if I really need all of them. But uh, I'm sure I ha as hell I'm gonna try to have all of them as much as possible at least. There we go. Oh, and yeah, I don't want that little Corvette over there. Yeah, I'm moving up every fighter in here, or at least the ones that I really need for now. I don't really need everybody. Let's move them up. I think I should be good with this amount of fighters. I should be good enough right now. Yeah, the, the Pride of the Core is pretty much OP. Just like the the, the Malevolence. Malevolence is, is kind of OP as well in this game, uh, in this mod, but it's not as... I got a feeling that like the Malevolence, what it's got, it's got uh, some sort of I EMP shield or EMP power... Uh, what is it called? EMP pa power or something like that. That's basically destroying us completely, but... It's not like uh, in the other like stuff. I don't know, boys. I don't know how to how to say it, but it's not it's not as OP as it sounds. Or really, it does prevent. It basically prevents you from going anywhere. It's a EMP for the engines, basically. All right, let's see what we can do with all the uh, this amount, boys. It's gonna be a little bit ridiculous. I'm not gonna lie. There we go. And there we go. We got all of our fighters. Every single one of our fighters. They're moving up. Now we're going to start moving up our forces. There we go. We're going to start moving them up as well. Let's do it, boys. We've got all these goddamn units. Let's just attack this guy really quick. Look at that damage we're doing, boys. Of course, we're going to do a lot of damage. Look at those fighters. I can't even see what I'm shooting at right now. There we go. Let's just shoot at all the the, the ships right now. 
and we're gonna take care of uh, this fleet right here of this little guy because it, uh, the, these guys these ships you have the angers we're gonna prevent them from having any angers we need the advantage uh, the fighter advantage we're gonna take out his engines I think we're good right take out his engines boys there we go we're gonna take out another one of those where's the angers there we go take out the angers my ship is almost there it's got a ra like the predator of the course got a, an enormous amount of actual firepower and also an enormous amount of aim and range it's pretty much yeah it's really op uh, the pride of the core boys it's just like they they have no chance the only thing they the, the only way they could defeat me is by having a lot of fighters and even then i don't know boys they will need a lot of fighters that's for sure actually we might want to take care of the angers there yeah, let's take care of the angers right now there we go going to start uh, taking care of all this all all this nonsense boys I'm gonna ask these guys to attack um, this guy part of the core you can actually attack this guy as well why not right that my uh, my fighters are getting destroyed actually so yeah they're getting pretty much destroyed right now yeah that's not good it got destroyed what I'm gonna have to do is all my fighters right here there we go I've got a bunch of new fighters there we go got a bunch of new fighters right now let's just take care of all these ships or actually don't let's put them um, on protection they're gonna protect us all these fighters are gonna protect us now there we go boys and as of you your job is to attack this guy right here so let's go look at that firepower boys holy we're gonna attack this guy boom all right just attack this guy concentrate your firepower everyone there we go you got it you got it that's my that's that's really cool i'm doing so much damage right now it's just the pride of the core itself it's just unbelievable let's go okay we gotta take care of this guy though that's for sure that's one thing that is for sure is uh we gotta take care of these ships and we got a lot of fighters still available at to this point so we're gonna uh, use all of them there we go just use all of the fighters to take care of the angers so let's go ahead and destroy those i've got all these sh these ships right here there we go let's defeat him and let's look at um let's look at the part of the core in cinematic mode boys don't know if we're actually gonna get uh, a good look at it but um i'm telling you it's so ridiculous oh there we go unbelievable all right let's uh let's destroy these yeah we're doing so much damage the damage we're dealing to these uh, to the enemy boys okay you guys really need to concentrate your firepower there we go let's concentrate your fire on him i also need this guy to do that don't know why it's not targeting it's actually not targeting right now which i it's a thing that i don't really like for some of these ships at least okay we're still defeating them we're still destroying them i'm gonna ask them to take control actually try to destroy this uh, you can continue yeah to assault them i guess continue your assault on them part of the core you're i'm gonna ask you to get the turbo lasers going start attacking these guys start attacking the uh there we go the anger we're gonna ask you to attack the anger as well all right everyone you know what to do prevent these guys from leaving there we go shield generator destroy it you got it 
That's that's what I'm talking about. That's a, a complete victory right there. Even though they had a lot of ships that managed to get away, we still destroyed like, yeah, there we go. Their fleet, we only lost a Dreadnought Acclimator and two cruisers. We lost nothing, boys. We didn't lose anything in this uh, in this war. So let's look at what we've got. We've got three uh, battles. The last video was a lot in sp uh, of battles in space. This one is going to be all about the battles in uh, in the ground, on the ground, boys. So we'll see how it goes, I guess. We're going to get a lot of dreadnoughts. There we go. I'm going to do, uh, like I said, I'm going to do the Obi-Wan's Assault first on Forost. Afterwards, we're going to do Kid, F uh, Kid Fistol's one. And afterwards, we're going to do the one with uh, Plo Koon and stuff. So let's go ahead and do Forost right away, boys. We have begin our uh, uh, embarkment into uh, this place, boys. We're ca starting ca the, ch the capture of the position. There we go. We're going to send Obi-Wan. And a couple of actually tanks. We're going to need some tanks. And I guess a couple of those as well. There we go. That should be fine enough on its own. Let's just start. It's going to be a pretty easy one. I feel like I feel like it's really going to be an easy uh, battle, this one, for Foros. There's nothing really protecting it. Let's just do that. Yeah, there's nothing really protecting uh, Foros. We're going to go over here anyways. Because I do need to secure this position. Okay, there we go. Hang on, hang on, hang on. There's some battle here. Obi-Wan, get your ass in here. Right, for now we don't need him, but uh, they are going to probably get some of the uh, Jordicas and we don't need that right now, so. Alright everyone, let's go. You know what to do. We're going to wait here until we capture the position. We did. Now we're going to send some platoon. Because we're, we're going to need at least two platoons. And we're going to send, I guess... We could send uh, Anakin as well. So we've got the two Jedi's. We've got Anakin and Obi Wan on the ground. Gotta be careful now because I don't know how strong they actually are in the game. I don't know if they're t actually strong at all. So that's why I want to be careful right now. There we go. Do we have it? We have it. All right. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna form up, we're gonna move up over here because we already know that uh, their base is, is over there. Let's move up. We're already, uh, we're already uh, skipping, uh, well, speeding up the game a little bit just because we know where to go. Let's go, boys. Let's attack these guys. Oh, hang on, there's a little bit of battle here, is that it? Let's attack these guys. Don't know what that is, but it was a base, some sort of base, so... Oh, hang on. Local. I think it's just a bunch of local militia. We are going to need to go over there. Look at the amount of troops they've got. So, hang on, hang on, hang on. They do have turbo lasers. Let's go, boys. Take care of these guys. Yeah. They've got some turbo lasers in here. We're gonna have to defeat the turbo laser right now. Where are my two Jedi's? Don't know where they are, boys. Oh, they're, they're right there. There we go. Okay, you guys. I'm gonna ask the, uh, my guys to to go over there because the they are tanks. And I need them right now. There we go. Okay, that's a lot of, yeah, that's a lot of enemies. Take care of these droidicas first. Yeah, that's a lot of, a uh, lot of soldiers, boys. Come on, take care of those. Okay, we're gonna need you to go over here. Let's go, boys. That's a big battle going on right now, boys. Okay, that's a, a droidicas right now. It's a little bit ridiculous. Look at the two Jedi's. Anakin and Obi uh, and Obi Wan doing the job, boys. All right, let's go. Take care of this uh, bad boy right here. I am uh, 
The only reason why we're doing so well is because I have the tanks and, and everything. God damn, look at all these troops. This shit is ridiculous, boys. Unbelievable. That's a, a lot of troops right there. I'm telling you right now. Yeah, there we go. Take care of these guys. Let's go, everyone. Unbelievable. Oh, my God. Okay, you know what? I don't have a... Can't actually shoot at them. Yeah, this is one of those things where I can't shoot at them for some reason. I do have some troops. Oh, these are enemy troops. Yeah, this is not going to go well at all. Okay, let's, now we can shoot at the, uh, these uh, these troops. There we go. With my two Jedis, this is what's saving me right now. It's the two, de two, the two Jedis. Let's attack uh, this turret, anti-infantry turret. There we go. This is really what's saving me right now. God damn. That was a, a big battle, boys, right there. Actually, we need a turbo laser right now. Let's go, boys. Move up right away. We need a turbo laser. Kill them. There we go. I think we're good. We will have lost. Uh, we will lose. A l we will end up losing a lot more soldiers than I wanted to lose. But that's okay, boys. Um, I guess we can go over here. We could uh, go over here and actually try to defeat these guys. So let's do it. There's they've got tanks, but I do have the turbo laser, so I want to shoot at them. Let's go, boys. There we go. Got the turbo lasers. They 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 do. I have tanks, but I feel like we should be okay. Let's actually. Let's just actually try a bombardment over here. Copy. There we go. We're going to see if it actually works out because... I don't know, boys. I don't know if it's going to work out or not. Oh, Anyan. I think we did manage to do some damage. I think we did. Yeah, we did destroy one of their tanks. Let's continue, boys. The assault. Let's do this. Okay, they've got more right here. This might be their last. This might be their last. It doesn't look like it. Let's get the position on the way. Let's go. Let's get the position on the way. Lock this one. Oh, they're, uh, they're moving out. They're actually moving out. So we won. We pushed them back out of Forost. There we go. That was a big battle. We actually didn't lose any troops. That's interesting. We did not lose any troops, boys. I was I thought uh, I thought we would have lost more than that but I guess not there we go let's just build these um, these two uh, build these outposts and stuff all to uh, the way to max so do I need more I don't think I need more I think I'm still good on that so we're good with the fleet now the fleet on Forost I don't know where I'm gonna send it I might actually send it over to Kaito Nemodia. We're gonna send uh, this one, the troops of Obi Wan to Kuat to be ready for the invasion. I'm gonna send a couple of uh, of these. Almost good with the fleet right here, so that's a good thing. We're gonna start the assault with Kid Fisto now, boys. I'm about as ready as I can be. So that's really good. Let's do the assault on uh, on Raxus Prime. Before that, I need to save. I need to make sure to save every time I win. Or basically every time I do a battle. Because I don't want to lose any progress. This game can crash at any moment. You never know. Alright, I saved up the game. Let's go ahead and do the battle of Raxus Prime. Now this should be an, easy, an, easier, an easier battle. Because it's only Drodikas. It looks like the best unit of the planet is Drodikas to defend it. See what we can do here. Let's begin the battle. Humans and Jawas are what's over here. That's true. We're going to send in, of course, our Jedi. As soon as we have the landing zone. There we go. We send in the Jedi. We're going to send another platoon. And we should be good enough with that. The, the Jedis and the platoons. Oh, that's a lot of droidicas, actually. I'm going to lose. Oh, my God. I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose him. Holy shit. Almost lost um, 
Yeah, 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 yeah. I almost lost uh, uh, Kid Fisto. He's not that great in this game. All right. In this mod, Kid Fisto is not that great. I got to keep that in mind. Oh my god, we're almost going to need to wait for the uh, reinforcements in here. The F Kid Fisto is really not a good unit in this game. I don't know why. Look at him. It never locks into the, the guy that I want to look at. A little bit frustrating if you ask me. Okay, boys. At least we've got the tanks to protect us. I'm going to send another another troop. Yeah, this one is actually tough. It's not actually tougher. I, I knew that the Drodikas were kind of like a little bit ridiculous. But not that ridiculous. Come on now. Okay, uh, we do have some troops right here. Okay, we're good. I think we're good. We need to start moving up and we need to start actually really every time we see something like that right here we're gonna take it boys all the way god damn shit is ridiculous let's actually destroy these there we go we're gonna we need to destroy these things i don't know what exactly they do some f kind of fuel and stuff but uh, i really need to to take care of it their base is over there but still boys I don't know this is gonna be it's gonna take a while okay all of you guys come on get over here let's see what uh, kind of damage it can do it's gonna deal let's see right here it's about to do it there we go we destroyed their plan their zone we did, we did destroy their, their thing now we gotta destroy the units, I guess. I imagine. This is not gonna be easy at all, boys. Holy. Alright, everybody. Everybody form up. I guess attack everything that you can see that is uh, that could eventually be a target. There's some uh, enemy troops right here, so let's shoot them up. Oh, there we go. We got him. I almost got Kiss Fist, though. I really wanna keep my Jedi's, boys. I don't want them to die at all. You know, I know I can basically uh, buy them again, uh, purchase them again, the ones that are not a part of the main heroes. But uh, still, man, I really want to keep those. There we go. We're going to continue doing that. We do have the Battle of Kato Nemoidia uh, ready, up and ready to go. Okay. So we did take uh, Raxus, Prime, and Forost. That's a good thing. Um, I feel like, yeah, I wanted to do the battle of Bestine first, but it looks like we're gonna do Kato Nemo, yeah, the space battle first. Now, if I auto resolve, it's probably gonna be a loss, boys. I am not gonna lie, it's probably gonna be a loss, but I don't feel like doing the battle, really. I don't really, don't really want to do the battle. Don't feel like it. Can I? Let's do it. Let's auto resolve. I know I'm gonna lose anyways. Yeah, there we go. Auto resolve is a bitch in this game. I knew I was gonna lose. I just want to do a uh, best team right now. And what we're gonna do, I guess, we're just gonna reinforce with a bunch of ships. It doesn't matter really. I didn't lose my hero. I don't think so. At least, yeah, I still got him. So, doesn't matter. Actually, these guys best team don't have anything. It looks like. Uh, they, it doesn't look like they've got really anything, so we can auto resolve. We only last one platoon, clone patro uh, trooper platoon. They are attacking us now. I think it's the fleet that was at Abergado Ray. They are attacking us at Duro. I don't have anything defending us, but I should be able to deal with that. That's not that much of. Uh, actually, they got 13 of those. God damn. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to... No, I'm, I'm going to have to resolve that, boys. I'm not going to be able to do anything against that. Uh, let's get a couple of platoons, a bunch of tanks, actually. There we go. Now, I do need to focus on that. So, let's just do everything, that all the builds that I got to do. There we go. Goddamn, they're already attacking me. All right, they're already attacking me. I want to do all the ships right here. There we go. Yeah, they're pretty quick when they... They seem like they're pretty quick uh, in this game. My fleet over here seems like it's ready. 
Yeah. I'm, I'm going to have to take out Kato Nemodia, that's for sure. They've got a big fleet over there. That's not good. We got to defend Duro, boys. Let's do it. All right, our job, defending Duro. Let's try to do it. We've got a lot of units, boys. A lot of units, so we're way good. We're going to send these guys over here. Same thing for you guys. Uh, get over here and you can secure this platform. And as of you, you can see clear, uh, clear up, secure this platform right here. Alright, I think we're good actually. Oh, there we go. That's where the unit are, uh, are at. Come on, boys. The, the AI seems like it's pretty stupid. It doesn't like, it doesn't get any platform at the beginning when it's invading. And it's actually not trying, like it already moves. It's just like me, but... It's not staying there to have the platform. It just moves out of the way. So they're pretty stupid in that sense. Okay, let's just... We'll continue building. We're good uh, actually with the units we've got on Duro. I really want to start building up um, a couple of dreadnoughts for uh, this fleet right here. We're going to need to do something here. I might actually need to get the... Yeah, to push them back. But I want to keep my advance, that's the thing. We already have all the ships over here, almost. Almost all of the ships. Yeah, this is not... I wanted to... I want to keep my advance right here, but it's not... Like, it's not gonna happen, it looks like. Um... Yeah, let's just send my... Send my fleet over here. I think somebody's approaching a, a planet or something. It's, they're going to try to attack me. Oh my god. They, look at the fleet they've got over Felucia, boys. They've got 28... Oh, little ships. 28 little ships. Uh, I might... I'm going to be able to destroy that. Um, yeah, this is not going to be a problem. I'm going to be able to destroy that pretty easily. No problem at all in that sense. Let's see what we got. Uh, what else we've got. Now we need to send this ship somewhere, right? So we need to do something, decide what we want to do next uh, for um, Duro. I, I, we can for sure destroy that fleet right here. But I don't feel like I want to destroy that fleet. That's the thing. I want to do, like invade planets and stuff. I want to push them back, but it doesn't seem like it's an option right now. I need to kill them off. And over here, what's going on over here on Rotana? I could probably try to... I will probably need to attack right now on Camino. I'm going to need to have the little ships done as well. Building ships over Rotana. Camino is going to have a big fleet and a good amount of troops, which I'm probably going to have to use against Ipori. I'm going to end up doing that for sure. They actually left. They left Duro boys. Okay, so what we're gonna do? Tactical battle imminent. Uh Felucia? Oh the battle of Felucia is okay, so we're good for the battle of Felucia. We're actually ready. First thing we're gonna do afterwards, we're gonna go for Duro. We're gonna go back to Duro. Um see if we, there's nothing we can really do. Doesn't I can't lock on the on best team for some reason, but our ship is on the way right here. Our fleet's on the way to Megiddo. Okay, that's good. Let's just do the battle of Felucia, I guess. This is going to be uh, the last battle of the video, boys. Let's do that battle, boys. We're beginning the battle. We're, we're going to destroy as much of these little ships as possible. They do have, like, what, 13 or 20 or something like that. They've got a lot of ships of these, uh, of this magnitude. So these are the, the like read the big what makes the the fleet so big that's the one thing that makes the fleet so big right now so we're gonna take care of these bad boys i'm actually gonna take care of this guy right here with my dreadnought what what are they doing where are they even going let's go boys there we go that's what i want you to do attack this bad boy um we are gonna get eventually assaulted by their fighters uh, probably but for now we're doing a lot of damage to them yeah we're dealing a lot of damage to them so for now we're just 
gonna have to continue doing their, our job um, you can start attacking these guys there we go just start uh, assaulting these guys well, same thing for you I guess yeah actually no I want you I want you to take care of uh, yeah I want you to take care of this uh, bad boy right here you can uh, start attacking these guys there we go start attacking this guy right here and boom there we go we destroyed every single one of their ships but we did end up losing a lot let's see what kind of casualties we got yeah we lost two destroyers four venators three cruisers and three dreadnoughts we need to yeah this is uh this was a really tough battle boys and we don't even have like look at my fleet it's not even a a good fleet anymore it's really a tough fleet that's uh doesn't have too much left what what hold on now what is the pride of the core doing here let's actually um build upon this wait this oh they're attacking us at 18 too we're gonna build a new fleet i guess for uh mace windu uh, army i don't know what just happened here and we're getting attacked here I'm gonna auto resolve. I don't want to deal with any of that. God damn! And they're they're about to attack us for sure. Okay, so let's just there we go. Let's just do that. I don't want to do any more battles in this game before they start attacking us again. Next video, boys, we're gonna attack underground Felucia, which seems to be a really well defended place. You can see how many troops they've got. Yeah, they've got a lot of troops, a lot of battalions. We got even some hair power and a lot of destroyers and tanks. This might be difficult, especially when you we know that um, Kid Fisto is not that great in the battle. Yeah, this might be interesting, boys. And we're gonna need to take care eventually of. Uh, eventually, yeah, we're gonna need to take care of uh, of Keto Nemodia, but I don't know. I can't seem to do it right now. Anyways, boys, we're building up our army right here, I guess. Building up our navies again. And we're going to do that. We're going to attack. We're going to attack Felucia. We're going to attack uh, Minulis. Probably def have to defend 18-2. Uh, we're going to need to attack Mechus 3 or Fondor. Or actually, we're going to push back. We're going to go and defeat these army in space. Gonna, so we're gonna free Duro basically, free Abrogado Ray, uh, go for Fondor probably actually. And next thing we're gonna do, so actually gonna go for Ipery. We might actually end up do, uh, going for Ipery as well. How many ships do I've got over there? I do have a good size, a good amount of uh, ship. I'm gonna go over there. All right. So here's my fleet. It's going to go over there. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to see you guys for the next one. Remember to leave a like and subscribe to the initial video. Keep it easy, boys.